guys, it's Miss Little Fabulous, and I'm back again to do another favorites video. I haven't done a favorites in about two months now. I think the last one, maybe it was a little longer than that. It has been about two months now. Um, I think the last favorites that I did was my May favorite. Um, but I found that there's a lot of products this month that I'm really, I have really, really have been enjoying. But half of the products are at my boyfriend's house. I didn't even bring them with me and I was like super bummed out about that, which is totally fine. So that means I just have, you guys can expect the September favorites because I can just add those products in there. And for those products, I'm talking about some of the motive products, but yeah. We'll talk about that when I have that. So to get started, let's start off with concealers. Huh. Been loving and still loving and will always love. I have been loving these two concealers. This concealer right here is the NARS Radiant Cream Concealer. Huh. Heaven, love this stuff. Love it. Mwah. I don't know what to say about it, but I love it. Like. I'm going to be super sad once I run out of this because I'm not going to be repurchasing, repurchasing this as much as I love it. The only reason why I purchased it because my best friend gave me a $200 gift certificate to Sephora. So, hey girl. So the only time I will be repurchasing this stuff is when I have a gift certificate because I'm just not paying for this with my own money. I'm, I'm just not. This was just ridiculously expensive and ridiculously worth it. So, absolutely love this stuff and I use this for underneath my eyes and on the bridge of my nose. My next favorite concealer is this L'Oreal True Match Crayon Concealer. Huh. Love this stuff. So let me tell you guys what I've been doing. I have been trying to work on my brows because once again there are a lot of people that talk trash about my brows and I don't care. Once again, these are my natural brows. I don't draw them on. Yada yada yada. So I have I watched um, You Loves Meg's brow tutorial and for some reason the way she filled in her brows made so much more sense than any other brow tutorial that I've been watching. So what I love this for, I actually use this underneath my brow bone after I um, fill in my eyebrows um, a little bit. I use this to conceal underneath and um, you know clean it up a little bit. I have not done that today because today I'm just going shopping because it's Labor Day and I'm trying to get some sales so I don't need to be that beat. But anyway, so yeah, I love this to conceal underneath my brows to clean up my eyebrows. Also, I love this to conceal underneath my eyes. But what I mainly love this for is those days that I don't want to put on foundation. Um, I just conceal underneath my eyes. My skin is pretty clear for the most part. I have a little bit of blemishes here and there, a little bit of redness. So um, I love this to conceal under my eyes. I don't have dark circles, but from the shadows on my face, it looks like I have dark circles. But when I go like this, I don't have dark circles. So yeah, it's weird. So I use this to conceal underneath my eyes and dab on any little blemishes and I, um, you know, just set it with my mineralized skin finish and that is it. That's what I love this stuff for. Ha! Huh, bomb. The next product I want to talk about is my NARS foundation. Okay, can we talk about this? This is the Sheer Matte Foundation. I don't know why they call it a Sheer Matte because it's not sheer to me. This is full coverage to me but I mean I don't know if I'm just applying more or what um but this is the sheer matte foundation from NARS absolutely love this stuff I'm gonna be sad once this goes away too because I'm not repurchasing this either I think this was like $45 thank you bestie for hooking up with that gift card so I'm just gonna have to wait till I get another gift card cuz huh this will not be coming out of my money okay anyways so yeah unless IMATS has NARS and I get a discount but yeah anyways I'm not trying to sound cheap, but I'm just saying, you know, some stuff can be good, but you know, we're in a recession and homegirl got a business to take care of and we got bills and stuff. I don't have money to just be thrown away like that anymore. I really don't. I like to stretch my money. As you guys know, I am a bargain shopper. So if I can get something on a deal, I will get it. So like today, Labor Day, totally out of the, um, you know, totally random, but today's Labor Day, about to hit the Labor Day sales and I'm not buying anything unless it's on sale. Okay. So once again, love this stuff, gorgeous, matches my skin to a T, okay? Love this stuff. I don't know what else to say about it, but I love it. The next product I want to talk about is this Maybelline Color Tattoo. Oh, 
these I'm just I'm not even talking just about this specific one I'm talking about all of them now I was sleeping on these now you know as YouTube gurus we buy into the hype everybody's ranting and raving about you know certain products and stuff so of course we go out and we have to try it for ourselves and everybody's on this big rant but after I bought these literally I'm gonna tell you after I bought these I bought about four of them I have this one. Um, this one is Toughest Taupe. I bought the gold one and the teal one. Or did I? I bought the gold one, the teal one, and the orange one. And I really wanted the orange one so freaking bad. Tell me why I ain't even opened that one yet. Huh. <laughs> YouTube. But anyway, so yeah, I love this stuff. Like, I was sleeping on it. I used it. I was just like, eh, whatever. But I've been using these in my kits for bases. What? love them okay like this stuff is legit the bomb like even when I take my makeup off at night I'm like oh my god this stuff is not coming off like legit I use a makeup remover wipe and then I have to go back in and wash my face afterwards to really get it off I love this stuff is just bomb I really like the teal one I'm not sure what that one is called but I love that one for my Ingla eyeshadows because I have a whole row of like teal eyeshadows and that really helps those colors to really pop especially if they're reflex colors like a pearl finish oh bomb bomb okay next item I want to talk about are these makeup remover wipes okay yes these are the cv oh right aid brand excuse me these are the right aid brand makeup wipes these are bomb and let me tell you why i'm talking about these okay i don't know how many of you guys go to imats and buy these makeup remover wipes lord jesus i hate these and i only bought them because missy lynn said she loved them and i forgot that i had them myself and i hate them i hate them because i don't feel like they're wet enough and there's not enough product on them and I'm really I really have to scrub scrub like when I'm taking my makeup off with these wipes like I really feel like the skin around my eye is raw because like I'm fighting so hard to get the makeup off of them like and I still have seven of these so I'm just gonna use those in my kits to like clean up a little bit but yeah I hate these so I had to go to the store and get some stuff because I don't want to you know the skin around your eyes is really delicate and I don't want to damage the skin around my eyes so I went and got these bad boys I normally use the CVS brand but I didn't go to CVS I went to Rite Aid and voila these are bomb and these are the Rite Aid Renewal Nighttime Calming Makeup Remover Towelettes love these and they're about $8.99 but they're normally on sale so you can get buy one get two free mm-hmm get it love those so the next product I want to talk about is this wet and wild eyeshadow palette and this is from their spring or summer collection this is the wet and wild color icon eyeshadow collection and this one is nude awakening and I actually use this in my back to school makeup tutorial so check that out if you haven't seen it but these eyeshadows are bomb wet and wild eyeshadows are mwah, superb great quality and once again even the other ones with the teal and stuff if you use a base like the Maybelline color tattoos these colors pop even more and they pop even more without a base but even with a base is just like that much more intense so absolutely love these these are only $4.99 um, and you can find them at Walgreens um, Actually, my CVS near my house is actually starting to sell Wet n Wild now, which I was super ecstatic about because I always have to go to Walgreens. And there's not that many Walgreens as there are CVS near my house. So, yeah, I love this. Only $4.99. So, if you are a beginner with makeup and you don't have the funds to really go out and buy any high-end stuff, check them out. And the last product I want to talk about is a skincare product and I'm actually getting back into this. I actually found this in my bathroom cabinet and I was like, oh my god, I forgot about this stuff. And it is actually a microdermabrasion. And this microdermabrasion is from Mary Kay. Yes, my mom introduced me to this back when I was um, in high school. She had actually had a Mary Kay lady come to the house. You know, she did a little girls night and did the facials, you know, as the Mary Kay ladies do. And we were hooked on this stuff and I have not used this in about five years and I once again I guess my mom repurchased it because I found it in the bathroom cabinet and I've been using this now you don't you only want to use this about twice a week because it is taking a layer of skin off your face but when I tell you my face just feels mwah, 
like baby's bottom love it so you have the microdermabrasion and then you have the finishing polish that you put on afterwards um once again you can really only purchase mary kay products through a mary kay representative um i'm pretty sure you can find a mary kay representative in your area but if you do get a chance to get this i suggest get it now once again like i said it's been a couple years since i used this and if i'm not mistaken this is runs between either 30 or 60 dollars pretty pricey but well worth it definitely so yeah you guys that is my monthly favorites i hope you guys enjoyed like i said i do have a lot more products but half of them are at my boyfriend's house so we're just gonna have to wait till september favorites to, to show you guys that but i'm getting ready to head out of here and go shopping so i can have a labor day haul slash back to school haul for you guys oh i forgot one product um dove yes Mwah. and this dove body wash is bomb it makes my skin feel like silk oh i can't even like oh i can't even like describe it to you guys and this one is plum and soca bloom scent whatever i'm obsessed with plum that's my absolute favorite fruit in the whole wide world and this stuff smells bomb makes my skin feel bomb but yeah i just wanted to mention that before i run out of time but as always you guys i hope you enjoyed remember to always rate comment subscribe follow me on twitter twitter.com backslash missiles of fabulous tv Twitter, twitter.com backslash missiles of fabulous TV. Did I just say that? Yeah. Facebook, facebook.com backslash missiles of fabulous. Remember, you guys have a nice and wonderful day. Bye.